Good evening everyone. Welcome to the YouTube channel Just Information. I hope you all are fine. Today we will learn Class 7 Science Chapter Light Part 4. In first part we have learned Phenomenon 3, Phenomenon 4 of Light and Electric Bulb. Now in this part we will learn about Fluorescent tube and shadows light images. This is the last part of this chapter. Now, fluorescent tubes. Fluorescent tube. First, fluorescent lamps use a different method to produce light. A tube light consists of sealed gas tube containing mercury and an insert inert gas like argon at very low pressure the inside of the tube is coated with coated with phosphorus powder which acts as a fluorescent substance how, how does it works at low pressure current flows through the gas low pressure current flows through the gas glass sealed glass flows through the gas after that Mercury atoms inside the tube use its current electrical energy to produce high energy. Mercury atoms atoms inside the Tube use this current. Use this current to produce high energy. To produce high energy. Energy. Now Invisible ultraviolet UV rays. When the UV rays fall on the coating, white light is produced. UV UV rays fall on the coating. Coating and it produces white light white light now there is electrons mercury atoms ultraviolet rays and visible light This is the, this is about electrons, mercury atoms and ultraviolet rays and visible light. Now here this type of line. Like this again here this 
small small particles also an arrow again at this side and this side small particles only the diagram now this small small particles are electrons electrons these particles are Mercury atoms. Atoms. The small line, lines like this. These are UV rays, ultraviolet rays. And visible light are this type of big arrows. Visible rays. After that, the topic is of shadows, light, and images. First, shadows are formed due to the property of rectilinear propagation of light. Shadow and light means, we, now we will learn the comparison of sh shadows and images. Light we had learned in the first part of this chapter. Now, first point is, Image of an object is complete in all details. Image of an object is complete in all details. In shadow, a shadow is a dark outline of an object means we can't see clearly the color of it and structure. We can only see the structure and the outline. A shadow is dark outline of an object. Now the second points are one more point. Image is formed when rays of light diverging is from an object co converge at the screen. Form, image is formed when rays of light diverging from an object diverging from an object coverage at the screen 
coverage at the screen. Now, the second point of shadow. Shadow is formed when the rays of light are obstructed by an opaque body. Formed. Formed. When the rays of light rays of light are obstructed by an opaque body. Thank you for watching today's video. I hope you have understand this both topics and tube light. And if you have any queries and any doubt, uh, please join the telegram link given in the description of this video. Thank you.